move it. That's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. What are you thinking? If we lean him on the horn, it'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. We gotta move it. It's locked. Then try something else. You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Block this! Hurry! Sarah, please. Who's out there? Luke! Clem? Oh, thank God. Did Nick find you? He made a run for it. Looking for help. I... I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know. Fuck. Fuck. I heard y'all banging through the door. Thought the walkers come to take what's left of us. We gotta get moving. I'll second that. Well, I would have left already, but I, I got Sarah here, and I, I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? We gotta help. Sarah, look, look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you that they're okay. Sarah, come on. We... we have to go now. Come on! We need to get out of here. Guys, we can't do this. We can't... we can't... we can't stay here! I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I... I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know, it was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then... while she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We're not out of the woods yet. What are we gonna do about her? Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I, uh... We're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay. So, we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta... Well, I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I could barely get her to look at me. Well... It's me. Hi. <laughs> Shit. I know how you feel right now. It's one of the worst feelings in the world. Ever since the walkers, so many people I know have died. People I love. And for stupid reasons. Crap, we're surrounded. 
What? What about the skylight? All we got. Clem, there's no time! Clem. When everything started, I met my friend Lee. He tried to help me find my parents. He protected me more than anyone else in my whole life. He died to keep me safe. I was so scared. But you're still here. Because he taught me to be strong, even when I'm scared. Because he wanted me to live. And your dad protected you because he wanted you to live. He would still want that. What's going on back there? My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. Clem, see what you can find. Can we use this? It's not big enough. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What would you? Oh, shit. Okay, ready? On three. One, two, three! We need you up top. Uh, 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 okay, come on! Clem! Sarah, we have to go! Are you listening? I can't do it. Now, Clementine! She doesn't want to go. You can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. I can't! I can't! I can't! Make me leave you! Come on! Dying like this is stupid! You can't save her, Clem. We have to go! Believe me, I know about this. Hurry up! <gasps> oh, move! <laughs> Clementine! Grab her! <sighs> We gotta go. Sarah. Come on. Uh, uh, okay. Look, I hate to ask this, but are we there yet? <laughs> We're not far. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. 
just the way things are. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? No. I mean, Clem, I wouldn't have to. And just because you got her out of there today doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell. When all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. But wait. Wait, where's Nick? Uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No. No. <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Just in case? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. Uh, I'll go in there. Thank you, Clem. I really do think that might be best. We need your help, with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. She didn't want me to wait. 
But I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. That beautiful face. So I waited. Sarita was a good person. I liked her. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Look, touch ya. Sarita. No peace. No rest. Punches just keep coming. Why the hell could Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That's not true. You help me. All the time. I need you. <sighs> I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. But, uh, thanks for saying that. Now, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Don't be stupid. It could be infected. Well? Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? We should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? Feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. What do we do? Penny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. It hurts more than before. Is something wrong? What kind of stuff do babies need when they're being born? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing, and blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. Museum. Seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? Just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem. I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her, make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful.
Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Did you find anything out here? Huh? Oh, uh, not yet. I hadn't really started looking until you showed up. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. A gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. Guess it's broken. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. 